And in particular, there are many places in the US where you have single family zoning, meaning the only kind of house that you can build in that neighborhood is a single family home, often with a yard of a certain size that basically prevents very dense development. Now that can be attractive for various reasons, but one thing it does is often excludes people, particularly from lower income families, from building houses or renting houses uh, that are smaller in better school districts, in places with access to better social capital, places that have better opportunities for upward mobility. One thing a number of cities did in recent years to address this type of problem is to create multifamily zoning restrictions or uh, regulations in places that previously were zoned for single family houses.